Hi guys! Welcome back sa YouTube channel ko. So for today, meron na naman tayong word problem sa algebra. So random math problem, specifically mga load this uh, under digit problem. So kung al naalala natin sa algebra kasi meron tayong iba't ibang klase ng word problems. May mga motion, clock problems, etc. So yung age, yung mga motion, meron din tayong digit problem na tinatawag. So marami pa ibang klase yung mga load, yung, may, yung mga ibang hindi pa na-mention ni Sir IG, kasali din yun, yun, dun, like yung mga variation problems, etc. So sagutan lang muna natin ito. Actually, this is very basic mga idol. So siguro yung analysis lang yung kailangan nating pagtibayan when it comes to this kind of problems. Okay, a certain 3-digit positive integer is 12 times the sum of its digits. Find the number. So pinaka first step na gagawin nyo sa ganitong klase ng problem, analyze how many digits does the number have. So, meron siyang 3 digits. So, let's say yung number natin is XYZ. This is a 3 digit number, right? Pero kung maalala natin yung mga place value, ang place value ng X ay hundreds. Yung Y ay tens. Yung Z ay ones. So, XYZ, if expressed in uh, yung pinaka-extended or standard form, so we have 100X plus 10Y plus Z. Kasi nga, considering the place values, Kunyari, yung 123. Yung 123, naging 123 yun. Kasi 100 times 1, plus 10 times 2, plus 3. Diba, ganun siya mga lodi. Okay, sir, IJ, nag-gets na po namin. So, itong number daw na to, so 100x, so, plus 10y, plus z, is 12 times the sum of the digits. So, ano ba yung digits natin? Diba, x, y, and z. So, x plus y, plus z. So, ang gagawin nyo lang naman dito, si simplify nyo lang. Pero, Sir IG, wala na ba tayo ba equation? Actually, yung mga lodi, wala na. So, kailangan nyo talagang analyze to maigi. So, meron tayong 100x plus 10y plus z is equal to applying distributive property of multiplication over addition. So, that is 12x plus 12y plus 12z. Simplify natin. 100x minus 12x. So, that is 88x plus 10y uh, so this is 12y so gawin na lang natin equals 12y minus 10y so that is 2y plus 12z minus z that's 11z eto na lang yung natira natin equation sa IJ, paano natin makukuha yung tamang sagot yan, e isa lang equation natin tatlo yung announce natin di ba sir IJ, sinabi nyo dati na kapag, kung ilan yung, kapag ilan po yung announce natin that will be the number of equations yes Pero for these cases, ito yung tinatawag natin na Diophantine equation. Hindi equal yung number of unknown sa number of equation. Pero, you can analyze further by checking the factors of the coefficients. Okay, makinig maigi. Tingnan nyo yung sa left side natin, 88. Ano factor ng 88? 8 and 11, di ba? Pwede rin yung 8, gawin mong 2 cube, right? So, sige, gawin natin itong 2 cube. Yung nasa right side natin, meron tayong 11 z. Obviously, this number is already divisible by 11. Because you have a multiplier of 11. So, kung ito divisible by 11, ito divisible by 11, ano masasabi nyo sa 2y? Okay, napaisip si Lodi, tama ka dyan. That should also be divisible by 11. Kaya lang, Sir IJ, pag yung y ko 11, hindi na siya pwede kasi it is considered as a digit of the problem. Therefore, para maging divisible siya, gagawin mo siyang 0. Kasi ang 0, divisible siya ng lahat ng numbers, especially... Uh, uh, exemption lang yung 0 din, syempre. So, yung y natin, hindi mo pwedeng gawing 11, kasi nga, 1 digit lang dapat yan, kasi digit yan. It follows that, therefore, y is equal to 0. So, yan, mas mapapadali na analysis natin. If this is 0, we have 88x equals 11z. So, divide natin both sides by 11, so we have 8x equals z. So, it follows that x over z is equal to 1 over 8. So, from that analysis, so, dinivide ko lang itong mga load, yeah? So, from that analysis, it follows na yung x natin will be 1 na. Kasi pag ginawa mong 2 to, z will become 16. E, eh, 1 digit lang siya. Yung z mo is 8. So, ano yung magiging 3 digit number natin? x is 1, y is 0, z is 8, therefore, the final answer is 108. Check natin. 1 plus 0, that is 0, ah, sorry, 1 plus 8, that's 9. 9 times 12, that is 108. Kaya tama po yung sagot natin. Napaka-basic lang po ng problem na to. So just in case you have questions or clarifications, huwag kayo may mag-comment sa comment section. Maraming maraming salamat mga Lodi Cakes. 
sa patuloy na sumusuport sa channel natin and pagpalaking kayo palagi ni Lord keep safe na lang especially pandemic ngayon so subscribe din pala kayo sa mother ko Mary Ann Mali yung kulay orange po yung profile niya and yun more on cooking po yung vlog niya and yun subscribe din po kayo kay mother and yun mga lodi sana mas maraming pa kayo matutunan sa mat channel ni Sir IJ sa mga susunod pa nating videos and yun keep safe mga lodi bye bye and God bless